In this video, I'm going to show you how to do affiliate marketing website completely free. You don't pay for hosting, you don't pay for domain name, and you don't pay for anything at all. The whole thing is free and it's not like those crappy free websites, but this is well-made professional website and the whole thing is free and it is very important for you to stay to the end of the video because at the end is where I show you how to get unlimited traffic again for free. So let's get started. So this is an example of the website that we'll be doing. It is something uh, similar to this. If you see here, like, you know, they are uh, doing, uh, they are selling uh, running shoes or they are affiliate marketers actually if you, they have many running shoes and they talk about them and if you click for example shop here, it goes to their uh, affiliate uh, product and uh, people buy here. So every time somebody buy, they get a commission. So as affiliate marketer, you'll be, uh, today we are going to do something similar to this and uh, you you will be affiliate marketer to Amazon or to any any other company and you put your products here and every time somebody clicks through your website and uh, buys the product you get a commission that's affiliate marketing so we are going to do something like this today step by step so to start go to this website uh, which is pantheon.io and what you need to do is start free and uh, uh, you need to, try, uh, to put your name. Uh, uh, my name is uh, for example, uh, company. Uh, let's say the company is running running shoes. And uh, email address. and password and country I am in Canada but you can put your country here uh, Canada uh, I don't want to receive marketing email then I agree and sign up then what you need to do you, you need to write your uh, information again uh, what I'm going to say here is autofill and password again Canada I agree then create an account then what I need to do login with email I need to write my type my email again and password So here what I need to do is start a new project. For the first time it takes uh, a little time but uh, after that it will be faster. Okay, so I need to write, uh, type the name of my website. Uh, let's say running shoes. And I am in Canada but you can like choose your country as I said for the first time it takes time but after that it will be faster when you uh, build more sites it will be faster now what I need to do I need to install WordPress what I need to do deploy And this takes a few minutes. Let me pause the video, the recording, then I'll come back when it's done. Now deploying the uh, WordPress is done. So what you need to do, visit your Pantheon website or si uh, the, the site dashboard. So after this, what you need to do, visit developer site. And you choose your language. My language is English. And site title is running shoes or you can just put your uh, site whatever it is so uh, username this is for wordpress now the username is i'm going to do it as admin and uh, the password i'm just going to leave it as it is but i'm going to copy it 
and uh, email I'm going to put my email then install WordPress then login admin and the password I'm going to paste that complicated password then I'll just do remember me just in case so now this is your WordPress uh, dashboard so there are a few things that we need to do first of all we go to plugin and there are two plugin installed we are going to uh, delete them just select all of them then uh, we do here delete then I apl apply delete it so now we are going to install one plugin and here you just type Astra and uh, starter template install after it is installed you click activate now it's, it is activated and uh, we are going to see the library or before that we are going to go to appearance and themes we are going to add a new theme again we are going to type Astra <clears throat> Astra is really popular theme but you can choose whatever theme you want but Astra is really popular and since we are going to use Elementor to build our websites we uh, uh, Astra is really recommended so what we need to do install and activate now we are going to go to starter template dashboard I'm sorry um, I, I mean to say we are going to go to a plugin and this is the starter template that we chose and we are going to see the library build with your website now and we are going to choose Elementor because we are going to use Elementor in this tutorial and we are going to click uh, to hover over blog then go to blogger and as, as you can see here like you now there are some paid and some free and most of them are paid but today we are going to do the free one so uh, if you see here premier that means it's, it's paid uh, uh, template so we are going to log for free for example this is free we just click on it and we say continue and you can actually change the colors and everything you want the font and everything but we are going to leave it as is you see it it really looks amazing what what we need to do we just need to change the pictures we need to do uh, to change the writing here the text and everything so we are going to do continue and uh, I'm going to write my name email address I am a beginner intermediate or it doesn't really matter they are just collecting data about you uh, for myself I agree then submit and build websites so this takes few minutes I'm going to pause the recording and continue later so after it's done this is the page that you'll be faced with so what you need to do view your website and this is your website it looks really amazing it looks professional but we just need to change the picture the writing and the color if you want and we are going to add some stuff uh, so let's start we are going to do dashboard and we are going to go to pages and uh, this is the home page so you see we have blog page uh, contact home page privacy you can add more you can delete some if you want but we are not going to do anything with, with that now so we are going to edit uh, the home page so just hover over it and you click on edit with Elementor so this is the page now and we can edit everything 
here is the logo you can use it because it is yours this is a free template you can use it or you can change it if you want to change uh, the logo you can uh, get somebody to design it for you or you, you can design it yourself with uh, Canva if you want uh, a lesson or tutorial how to design a logo just let me know in the comments and I'll make a video about that so now first of all we are going to uh, change this picture we are going to click here and we are going to go to style and we are going to click on the picture and you can get export your picture or import your picture here if you have a picture if you don't have we are going to use the free images we are going to write or type running shoes and these are all uh, royalty free pictures you can use uh, let's look for something that is nice uh, it's just hard to choose but uh, okay let's just use this one where did it go let's choose choose this one and we are going to click insert media and you see here you can change it anything you want you can put your own uh, picture if you want so to change the text what we need to do just click on the text and you see on the left side here so we are going to delete it and say uh, best running shoes for women uh, here uh, uh, for example let's say your website is name is Kara which is Kara here and uh, say uh, for example uh, K Or A, I guess. Kara, or you just put like, you no, know, whatever you want. And uh, read more. Uh, for example, th this one, you don't, you don't want it. Like, you know, uh, you want to delete it. What you need to do, just click on it here and delete. Also, this one, this section, you don't need it. Just delete and uh, we go here um, okay we don't need this one so uh, if you notice like you no know, these are sections you see this is the a whole section inside this section there is a section so we are we don't need this one just what we need to do just the X delete it we don't need this one just delete it uh, we are going to use this one and I'll show you how so for this section what I'm going to do is uh, this uh, I write for example I change this text and say uh, see our uh, picks for the best running shoes for women and I'm going to put uh, running shoes pictures here I'm going to put a little name uh, the name of the shoes or a description or whatever it is and below that I'm going to put uh, what you call that I'm going to put uh, bo two buttons the first button is learn more which is they can just click that one and go to your blog and read about the shoes uh, the second button will be buy if they click buy they go directly to Amazon or whatever you are affiliated with and they can buy and every time they buy they, you get a commission so what I'm going to do here uh, first of all this section I don't need it just delete it and here I click here and I see uh, see our best picks of running shoes for women and here I am going to change this picture so what I need to do just come here just click on it and click on the picture here and here we were searching for running shoes and let's see good running shoes here 
let's see this one as an example click on it and insert media and we are going to click on this uh, nine dots and we are going to do heading just click on it and drag it and put it here and we change it to uh, h4 and and let's put a title or the name of the shoes uh, this is just an example of course you have to do a better job so what i'm going to do uh, red running shoes you have to come up with something better or the description of the shoes and what i'm going to do uh, below here i'm going to put a button uh, again i click these nine dots and you see this button i'm going to grab it and just and just put it below this i'm going to put it in the middle and or this one is is up to you i'm going to change the color uh, let's say for example warning or no it doesn't look good success yeah green looks good and uh, i am going to change the color of the text what i'm going to do here uh, text color i'm going to do this and black so what i am going to do now i add another button just grab it and put it here again and uh, green or you can just put another color if you want uh, red and i'm going to change the text color put it black and here I click on the button and and I'm going to say uh, learn more and for this one I am going to say buy buy now now we have to do all these three the same thing so what i'm going to do uh, instead of typing i'm going to copy this and paste it here so what i am going to do uh, click on this one right click then delete again this one right click delete and for this one right click and delete so this one right click and duplicate and again this one right click and duplicate and uh, let me add another one right click and duplicate so now we just need to change the pictures this one i'm going to change it get another picture running shoes okay i'm going to get this one <coughs> insert media this one i'm going to change the picture again click on this and again we search for running shoes and uh, let's do this one oh, where did it go uh, let's do let's do this one insert media <clears throat> oh we have that already so I'm going to change it I need vertical pictures so it will be the whole thing will be balanced uh, let me see this one because the pictures are still loading <coughs> Search media and uh, we need to change this one again we search for running shoes 
we are going to choose this one. Oh, where did it go? Okay, let me do it again. I don't know what's happened. Running shoes. So I had to stop the recording and look for uh, a better picture, uh, but of course, like you know, you have to do a better job than me. So now we are going to uh, change the description of each one. Uh, let's say this one, uh, yellow, running shoes, and this one, uh, I don't know, like no, uh, we say uh, pink, running shoes as I said you have to do a better job than mine here but uh, this is just an example uh, green okay so now we have the pictures and we have the description we have the buttons now we have to assign something to these buttons so for buy now it, it is very easy for example if you are an affiliate uh, an uh, affiliate to Amazon uh, what you need to do is uh, you go to amazon.com and get your affiliate link for example here I'm going to write uh, running shoes for women and uh, let's say as an example this one so you will have your affiliate link which is uh, you can uh, um, you can click on or you can you know how to get your affiliate link so what you need to do is just copy your affiliate link and uh, go here come to the bottom and uh, you see uh, what it says here link and just paste it so what happens is every time somebody clicks on this buy uh, it goes to uh, amazon your through your affiliate link it goes to amazon and when they buy you get a commission it doesn't have to be amazon but whatever you are affiliate to and we are going to do for all these red buttons but uh, for the green buttons it's supposed to be learn more so when uh, that means you have a blog you have somewhere written uh, somewhere that you wrote about these shoes so now i'm going to show you so we are going to update this save it so we are going to exit from this home page and uh, exit again click the wordpress sign here so we are going to go to post so if you see here like you now you have some posts these are sample posts that came with the theme or with the starter template uh, you can just delete them all you don't need them uh, move to trash apply so now we you are going to write a, a blog post about that certain running shoes so what we need to do is add and that was uh, red running shoes right shoes then we are going to edit with elementor or we go here first and template discussion uh, all looks good just want to make sure everything looks good here Okay, disable heading, uh, disable the whole thing here. We are going to do edit with Elementor. So this is a blank page that you can edit. So what you need to do, first of all, is uh, uh, you are going to do the plus sign then here, and we are going to put a title. Title is red 
running shoes are going to put it in the middle and you are going to change it to h1 when you write a blog post you have one h1 but the rest is is uh, is is something different uh, like you no know, h2 and h3 so uh what we are going to do now since we don't want to write the whole thing i'm going to search for running shoes I'm just searching on another window here. <clears throat> Let's see, for example, uh, we are going to take this title and uh, I'm just copying and pasting because I don't want to write the whole thing now and I don't know anything about running shoes. So what we need to do here, we grab the texts and put it here and I'm going to paste whatever I wrote and I'm going to put an image the image will be the red running shoes I'm going to put a title again I'm going to put a heading Uh, this time is h2 paste and I'm going to talk about it and copy <clears throat> and paste here and you continue like that just write a blog post about this running shoes and everything and at the end you are going to put bottom can do it middle can do it like this and you can see here by now and I'm going to change the color of this button green and I'm going to change the text black so for this buy now you can put uh, the link of Amazon or whatever your affiliate marketing uh, website is so I'm going to put here so now people come and read and if they like what they see they are going to click here and buy the shoes every time they buy the shoes you are going to get a commission because you are a affiliate marketer so now you are going to put uh, of course you have to write if you are affiliate marketer and you are a blogger you have to write a lot about affiliate about branding shoes or whatever your niche is so now we are going to do publish now we are going to exit and exit to WordPress and you see now we have one post what we are going to do right click on it and uh, copy the link and we are going to our pages and the home page we are going to edit with Elementor again and you see we wrote about these shoes now so what you need to do when you people say learn more or click learn more you are going to put your uh, uh, your uh, blog posts uh, uh, link so this one you can change it to something else or you can just leave it as is it's up to you you can change the picture you can delete the whole thing you can delete the whole thing here so the idea is you get the idea like you can't you can 
do a, a website like this and but you have to learn a little bit about Elementor. I just, what I showed you is just enough, but if you want to improve, if you want to make your website uh, better uh, in the future, for example, like, you know, here we have uh, four, but if you want to add more, what you need to do, just click on this one, right click and duplicate. See, you have more, so you can put more shoes and uh, more links and the, the more you write, the, 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 the more links you have, the more pictures you have, right? So you just continue on that. So this is the idea of how you do affiliate marketing website for free. And uh, of course you have to play around with that and you have to see what you need to learn and uh, uh, that's it. So. Um, as I promised, I told you, uh, I'll tell you how to get uh, traffic because even if you have the most beautiful website, the most useful website, if you don't have traffic, your business is dead. But uh, I don't want to make this video uh, really long, but if you want uh, to get free traffic uh, in, 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 in minutes, uh, I have another video. You can see it somewhere here. I'll just just post it here and uh, good luck and uh, if you have any question just put it in the comments below and i'll answer any question every question i answer and good luck until next time bye